Kevin Durant's introductory press conference. A palpable buzz in this city as DeAndre Ayton left it short. Here comes Mann, has some help in Zubats. When you want to win all the time, you didn't. Probably embraces this a lot more knowing the opportunity. A little bit of a shaky offensive start continues for the Suns. They turn it over. When you want to win all the time, you didn't. Probably embraces this a lot more knowing the opportunity. A little bit of a shaky offensive start continues for the Suns. They turn it over. So he had to go small in his second unit. That means you're playing players out of position. You can't really operate your offense the way you want. What that does is allow him to now play Nick Batum, uh, Covington, in their natural roles and natural positions. Now you can run the offense accordingly. Someone who has been on their radar, Jimmy, for the last couple of years. He is finally now joining the Clippers. What a finish by man. So five-point Clippers lead as we cross the eight-minute mark. Look at Zubats getting out against Booker. Man in the open floor. Hard right-handed flush. Chris Paul gets into the paint. Okogi against Man. Couple of young bucks. This is Aiton. Tough turnaround. Missed it. It's a lot of the videos we've seen the last couple of days, he's been working out with KD, you know, putting pressure on him, playing defense, and helping him on his process as well. So another relationship. That's the thing we keep our eye on. When they stay in flow in the offensive end. Dennis just likes to get those DMV references. <laughs> as as of course, can. you know that's real. You know that's real. Jimmy, they start getting this kind of production from Terrence Mann. Well, this is going to be an even tougher Clippers team to contend with as we get a whistle here. So they reset out to a Kogi. Pass inside. They turn it over. Zubats with a rip. Ahead of the field is Mann. Lines it up. Splash. Runners around the screen into the corner. This is Mann. Step back three. Too much. Now Monty Williams just trying to temper expectations. Zubats! Clippers have hit a bit of an offensive wall here. Ball inside, gets it to Aiton, misses a layup. Zubats, the fifth best offensive rebounder in the league this season. Six seconds to shoot. Ball looking for some daylight. Mid-range jumper won't go on the rebound by man. Suns coming in off their Tuesday home win here over Sacramento. That's Booker. George nearly another turnover. Clippers a home winner Tuesday. This is Mann swooping in. Right-handed finish. There's going to be an adaptation process for Aiton. It will be, but I think where he can benefit is with the right attitude is on the second unit. Less shots in that first depending on the matchup. But you can still impact the game by, you know, manning up the middle. So, Jimmy, just wonder how long it will take to get Durant up to speed with his new team. They'll eight weeks before the start of the NBA playoffs. How quickly can the Suns put it all together? And what we'll they hope will be a deep run through the postseason. Leonard, beautiful drop off to man. Why Leonard, if you've just joined us, still has not scored in this game. He's 0 of 9 from the field. Man, boy, he is lighting up the night for the Clippers and picking up some of that scoring slap for Leonard. And it comes two nights after he was electric in their Tuesday win over Golden State. 33 points in that win. And you just think of all the weapons and, and all the different things that Plumlee can give you. Such a versatile big. Terrence Mann is starting to cook for the Clippers. And they're going to be keys to coming off the bench for both teams. But you made the point when we were talking at a halftime about this and Paul George with a nice shot that being professional has value. Get it back here. But you just see the, the quickness of Paul George. Incredible, Jimmy. Look at Mann as his monster night continues. Gordon, no rush. Gets it to George as the Clippers reset. Seven to shoot. Paul George, 26 points. What a pass. Zubats back door to Mann. 